So friends, welcome back to our channel Learn with Gigs. In this video, I will discuss on a very important and critical topic, and that is how to deal or negotiate with 90 days notice period. Okay, I believe almost every second person faces this problem in our country, and it's very unfortunate that still this 90 days notice long long notice period duration exists. And the sad part is that even the companies who has its own notice period of 90 days. looks for candidates who can join immediately or within a month okay so today we will be focusing on different possible options that a person can opt to deal with this huge period of notice and these are purely my opinions and i am not influencing anyone to opt anything ultimately it's you who have to decide what you should go for okay so let's start with the option number 1 okay so let's move to the option number 1 and this is convince the recruiter so first of all if you have the 90 days notice period the probability of getting the calls is very low you know that hence it is very necessary to make your resume good with all the relevant keywords written there as recruiter gives hardly 8 to 10 seconds to analyze your resume i have already uploaded two videos based on creation of resume both for freshers and experienced persons for power bi So if you want you can check out those two videos also I will provide the link in the description box okay so now you have kept kept these points in your mind and properly uploaded your resume on platforms like nokri and somehow you get the interview call okay so once you get the interview call it is very necessary to convince the recruiter that you can negotiate or will be able to reduce your notice period to 2 months at least and get the interview done and that you could do by saying that your project is about to complete within one or one and a half months and you have a good rapport with your manager so he would be releasing you early so this is one of the examples that you can use you can tell your own example okay so in this way he would agree to schedule the interview call and once you clear all the interview rounds okay once you clear clear all the uh, uh, interview rounds then definitely 90% of the times or even greater than this percentage company waits for you even for 3 months also okay so this is all about option number 1 that is convincing the recruiter okay and this is the most natural one okay so that's why i kept it as num no, option number 1 so now let's move to option number 2 okay and i hope the option number 1 is clear to you okay so option number 2 is resign without having any offer what is what does that mean so if you have already applied on different platforms and still you are not getting even a single call for interview then you could opt for this option okay and here the only condition is that you should be confident about your knowledge you have to trust yourself that you will be able to clear the interview as you have the deep knowledge about your relevant skills so in this case without having any offer give the resignation and just keep applying and as your notice period duration will decrease the more you will get the calls and majority of the calls come within the last one month duration so trust yourself and keep applying and i have seen a lot of people going for this option in today's time okay and also i want to mention one more important thing here that you should keep in mind that you are not giving this resignation when every other company is doing mass layoffs so choose the proper time to go for this option okay so timing is very important for you to go or opt for this kind of option okay so this is all about option number 2 now let's uh, let us move to the third option and that is the final option that i wanted to share with you okay so option number 3 write 2 months on nokri.com as your notice period duration what does this means so in this case mention your notice period to 2 months on nokri or other platforms so if it is 2 months then it is very likely that you will get the interview calls and once you clear the interview rounds for a company take the offer and then talk to your manager about resignation and also the option of getting early release by paying out the 1 month salary amount so if your salary is not much then you can opt for this and pay that 1 month amount to your current organization and get the early release so it is very important to have a good rapport with your manager and then only this option would work out for you okay so this is all about option number 3 so that is all i wanted to share with you all through this video 
i hope this video would help you to reach to a conclusion how you should approach or go for a switch okay and please let me know in the comment box if you have any other option in your mind or if you have any option that you have tried out and has worked for you to get the interview calls so that every uh, so that it can help the other people also okay so that's it thank you for watching the complete video and stay tuned for the upcoming videos thank you